Hey guys, welcome to another tutorial today and this is going to be about exporting your maps or your asset from Substance Painted 2 into Unity 5. So I've got myself um, an asset here that I made and I've textured it using Substance. Now we want to be able to export this for use in Unity 5 and people who are more advanced will know what to do. But if you're new to the software and you want a quick guide, just go File, um, Export Textures, obviously have to use textured your asset you'll get the um, export document sort of wizard out here and we can click on the configuration tab and we can run down to the unity 5 standard metallic is the most common um, type that we're going to export out to you can do the specular uh, setup if that's what you've chosen to do when you started up your substance document but we'll choose the standard metallic and we will get these um, channels by default so we'll get emission normal metallic smoothness and albedo transparency and these are the ones we need by default now if you do have an ambient occlusion map that you might have baked out during um you know when you were part of this asset you might want to add that channel so all we need to do is click at the top where we can go create we want to create a gray channel and we want to in the mesh map slot we want to add ambient occlusion to this side and choose gray channel and then what we like to do is just copy um, a texture set above, paste it in here, and just rename the emission to AO or something like that. So we're going to have the albedo, the metallic roughness, the normal, and the AO. You can, it will export a mission, an emission map if you have one on a channel available. We can go export. Then we can choose what file format we want. So usually a tag is good, eight bits, and we want to choose the configuration. So we want to choose Unity 5 standard metallic, which matches what we just made in the configuration. Um, you want to set whatever document size you want to export your textures out. So I'll just use 2K. And we want uh, this uh, texture set here. And then you want to choose where to save it. So I'll just save it into my Unity project. So once I've selected which um, where I want to save it is we'll click export and it will run through that. It may say there's some warnings. That's probably because it can export the emission map because there's no emission channel actually on my model. So now I can go into Unity again. And this is the scene that I already had open before. All I've got in this scene is a plane with a dark material on it. I've already imported my FBX model into Unity. And if you're not aware of how to do that, you can just right click import new asset and choose whatever file format your model is. I've set it to just generate light map in UVs and it's going to bring the material in for me. So I can just put my texture straight on. We can add this into the Unity scene. What I'll do is I'll rotate this. 90 degrees just so it's upright put it in front of the scene here we'll zoom in a little bit and we can drop down on the living room mirror and we want to just add the albedo transparency uh, we want to add the ambient occlusion that we added specially we want to add the metallic smoothness and we want to add the normal map and it might look a bit weird until you click fix and now. And then when you click fix now, you'll see in the scene, and there's material with the maps added. You can add the emission if it's available and the height if you've exported that out, if you have that on your model. But other than that, this is just a simple way to export the materials from Substance Painter 2 out into Unity 5. So thanks very much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Cheers.